Chapter 11 Now the leaders of the people were living in Jerusalem, the holy city, at this time. A tenth of the people from the other towns of Judah and Benjamin were chosen by sacred lots to live there too, while the rest stayed where they were. And the people commended everyone who volunteered to resettle in Jerusalem. Here is a list of the names of the provincial officials who came to Jerusalem. Most of the people, priests, Levites, temple servants, and descendants of Solomon's servants, continued to live in their own homes in the various towns of Judah. But some of the people from Judah and Benjamin resettled in Jerusalem. From the tribe of Judah, Athiah, son of Uzziah, son of Zechariah, son of Amariah, son of Shephatiah, son of Mahalalel, of the family of Perez, and Measiah, son of Baruch, son of kol son of Haziah, son of Adiah, son of Joerib, son of Zechariah, of the family of Shelah. There were also 468 descendants of Perez who lived in Jerusalem, all outstanding men. From the tribe of Benjamin, Salu, son of Meshalum, son of Joed, son of Pedeiah, son of Kolehiah, son of Measiah, son of Ithiel, son of Jeshiah. And after him there were Gebei and Selei, and a total of 928 relatives. Their chief officer was Joel, son of Zikrai, who was assisted by Judah, son of Hasanua, second in command over the city. From the priests, Jediah, son of Joarib, Jachin, and Seraiah, son of Hilkiah, son of Meshulam, son of Zedak, son of Meraoth, son of Ahitub, the supervisor of the temple of God together with 822 of their associates who worked at the temple. Also there was Adaiah, son of Jeroham, son of Pelaliah, son of Amzai, son of Zechariah, son of Pashur, son of Malkijah, and 242 of his associates who were heads of their families. There were also Amashai, son of Azarel, son of Azaiah, son of Meshilamoth, son of Emer, and 128 of his outstanding associates, their chief officer was Zabdiel, son of Hagadolim, from the Levites, Shemaiah, son of Hashub, son of Azrakam, son of Hashabiah, son of Bunai, Shabbatai, and Josabad, who were in charge of the work outside the temple of God. Mataniah, son of Micah, son of Zabdai, a descendant of Asaph, who opened the thanksgiving services with prayer, Bakbukiah, who was Mataniah's assistant, and Abda, son of Shamua, son of Gelal, son of Jeduthun. In all, there were 284 Levites in the holy city. From the gatekeepers, Akub, Talmon, and 172 of their associates who guarded the gates. The other priests, Levites, and the rest of the Israelites lived wherever their family inheritance was located in any of the towns of Judah. However, the temple servants, whose leaders were Zaicha and Gishpa, all lived on the hill of Ophel. The chief officer of the Levites in Jerusalem was Uzai, son of Benai, son of Hashabiah, son of Mataniah, son of Micah, a descendant of Asaph, whose family served as singers at God's temple. They were under royal orders which determined their daily activities. Pethahiah, son of Meshezabel, a descendant of Zerah, son of Judah, was the king's agent in all matters of public administration. Some of the people of Judah lived in Kiriath Abba with its villages, Dibon with its villages, and Jacobziel with its villages. They also lived in Jeshua, Molada, Beth Pelet, Hazar Shual, Beersheba with its villages, Ziklag and Mekona with its villages, they were also in En-Rimon, Zorah, Jarmuth, Zanoa, and Adulam with their villages. They were also in Lekish and its nearby fields and Azekah with its surrounding villages. So the people of Judah were living all the way from Beersheba to the valley of Hinnom. Some of the people of Benjamin lived at Geba, Michmash, Aijah, and Bethel with its surrounding villages. They were also in Anathoth, Nob, Ananiah, Hazor, Rema, Gitaim, Hadid, Zeboim, Nebalat, Lod, Ono, and the Valley of Craftsmen. Some of the Levites who lived in Judah were sent to live with the tribe of Benjamin. 